Now, I played Gary's mod, but I've never quite experienced something very heinous in a game other than people talking shit in a multiplayer game. But this one is quite worse than that. And the only difference is that it's a single player add-on. I'm talking about an add-on for Gary's mod called the Glue Library. On June 3rd, 2022, there was an ear-piercing jump scare that shows a very graphic, disgusting image that should not be specified. Here is the story of a traumatizing day for Gary's Mod players. The Ukraine war happened on January 2nd, 2022, and it took a mental health toll on the Russian and the Ukrainian citizens. As time goes by, things started to get worse. A guy sits on his computer and works on his mod like he usually does. The man's name is Anonymous, but he goes by many names. He updated his mod in the dev branch in case that people assured that there were problems, but the users get a lot of Lua errors. He thought that he did a successful job doing the whole fixing, but it turns out that he did not. The owner of the add-on got bombarded by a lot of messages on WhatsApp telling him to fix the add-on. And that took more toll on his mental health, unfortunately. Safe to say that he also didn't really have a lot of money, and he was furious by the fact that there was no paid add-on option. Confused and filled with fury, the owner of the add-on had to do something. He typed in threat messages to Gabe Newell on the script of his mod, and decided to add a feature that would haunt players for the rest of their lives. Many players decided to get on Gary's mod so they could eventually blow off their steam after work, school, or whatever they usually did. But then, when they didn't know they had the add-on and pressed W, a very loud screamer with a picture of someone's ass stretched out very wide shows up on their screen. Many people are aware of the incident. Videos, memes, and reddit posts are made on the internet. This incident also eventually got the creator of the add-on banned from his Steam account. And it's safe to say that it made such a whole impact on the internet that it inspired another creator of an add-on that goes by the troll face player model to do the same thing, but to troll people. This is definitely even worse than what you'd expect. It's not just asses, it also contains slurs, very disrespectful imagery, fat men, with the addition of slurs set by an uber duck version of Spongebob. I saw on a reddit to spare your eyes, so don't worry. I don't think the impact is going to really end when it comes to this day. It has impacted a whole generation of Gary's Mod players and the whole gaming community. It even shocked me too when I first heard about this, but never really played Gary's Mod on the same day since I forgot about the game. If you, however, experienced this particular thing, then I'm very sorry to hear that. No! 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 